Welcome, welcome back to True Hall of Fame Builds. I am your host, Michael May, and today we got to talk, y'all. We got to talk. See, hear me out, right? Hold on, let me fix this. Because I know I move around a lot. And I want my camera to be all right. That's, that's a little better. All right, so hear me out. First of all, we're going to start with this video right here, right? Nah. I want to give everybody they love you know what i'm saying fair use i'm gonna be reacting to a few different videos today right and i really want y'all to pay attention right now hit me out yeah know, yeah know i'm gonna do redo yeah know i'm gonna do retakes so we're gonna go like this but there it goes so hit me out um 2k community is in the uproar what i'm gonna say is this Everybody wants an advantage at what they do. No, hear me out. None of y'all, none of y'all want a good competitive skill gap game. Though you be crying, oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 I want the skill gap and I want the. All y'all do is cry like little babies. Mike Wang, hear me out. I'm going to speak to you with logic. And hopefully the rest of the 2K community can understand this, right? So this, so the first video we're going to react to, right? Now, this is Swante. I respect Swante. As you guys can see, I'm already subbed up to his channel. I show love to the community. You know what I'm saying? If somebody be on their job, I show love to the community. You understand what I'm saying? You, you dig. So hear me out. But Swante, I don't agree with you here. I cannot agree with you. Right now... I can't agree with you because I want, I want all of you, all of you in the 2K community. I want you to watch this now, mind you. Hold up, because I want y'all guys to understand something, right? I'm not, I, I, I don't like the lion shit. Now, I want you guys to see. Was it this one? Yeah. So I responded under this video for Swante, right? I said, first of all, where my man? Where my man is? If you are new to the channel, like the video, subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by November first. That's the that's my goal. Help me get there. It costs y'all nothing to press the subscribe button and press the like button. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm going to be dropping heat. I've been doing this for just, just a little over a year. And I'm so grateful for all the momentum that I've been gaining because of y'all. This, this is for y'all. Now, um, I want to get into this video. I'm, I'm going to let Swante talk. And then we're going we, gonna to stop and break this up. Let's go. Swante, the first one. Look, hey, this is a comp dribbler saying this, okay? He be playing stage and all that. A lot of y'all, y'all don't get to face. Now, mind you, he's already speaking about a comp dribbler. Now, one thing I know about, I've watched all the videos, all them little comp dribblers. What I've learned about these dudes is this. They feel all, like, like, like they could dribble in front of 50, 60 dudes and not get ripped. That's the bullshit. That's the shit that we got to get rid of in this 2K community. Now, Swante, let's, let's keep going. Face comp or lockdowns because you play such bots. But then when you play someone for real, for real, you're going to see what the game really is. A lot of y'all are, you have a secluded, a delusion of what the game really is. A lot of the people you're playing, they don't even have glove on. <laughs> y'all don't even even know that <laughs> but y'all keep saying don't patch it but it's like, it's like for instance most of y'all didn't play left right last year right but y'all had such a problem with it right and i'm not no left right component fuck left right fuck all the little uh small ass point guards but I'm, I'm saying a lot time out now yeah fuck the left right that shit is corny if you gotta play like that i don't consider you a comp person we're going left and right that's comp that makes you comp to dribble out the whole crack, that makes you comp. If that's what makes you comp, I don't want to be comp. I don't want to be comp. I'll continue to be a competitive player. 
I played the game competitively, but if left and right is what makes you comp, I don't want to be considered comp. I never even want to be associated with any of y'all niggas. But what I will say is this. We don't know, but you heard what he said? Most of these guys, they don't run glove. Swante, we don't know. We just don't know. So who's to say the guy that was ripping him was a straight lock? We don't know. So we can't make those assumptions. But see now, whether, now, now you want to say most, but we don't know. We don't. So we can't assume. But what I will say is this. It's unfortunate that because these guys are comp dribblers and they can't dribble the way they used to, it's a fucking problem. That shit is corny. You want to know why? Hear me out. I let me t listen to what I gotta say. Hear me out. If I got if I got Hall of Fame clamps, I got Hall of Fame challenger, I got Hall of Fame glove, right? I'm a defender. Now, you got Hall of Fame unpluckable. Great. You got Hall of Fame handles for days. Great. You got whatever other Hall of Fame badge you wanna have. So that's Hall of Fame for Hall of Fame. So now, both badges should cancel each other out, and now the talent should show, right? Right? That would make sense, right? See, what y'all niggas want is, y'all want because somebody's a dribbler, y'all want these niggas to dribble their life away. Why? And to, and Ronnie, I, I hope you're watching. I, I'm going to send this to you. I hope you watch this video. Thing is this. You wonder why viewership is down? You want to understand why viewership is down? Why? Nobody wants to sit there and watch a 2K competitive game, five out, dribble, 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 dribbles, big screen comes over here, dribble, dribble, hear me out. I paid the same 150 as the next man did, as the next man did, as a, to what, sit in the fucking corner and just dribble, 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 oh, now I'm going to pass the ball because they closed. D this is what you wanted. You wanted a team sport, right? So y'all guys got it. But now listen, Swante. Now, now, now I gotta zoom in. I gotta zoom in right now. I need y'all guys to see this full screen. Pay attention. A lot of y'all don't get to face comp lockdowns, so y'all should still have a problem with this too. Let's go into this video right after we read what this nigga gotta say. So Impectual said, "Tone down the steals, or we boycott in 2K23." <laughs> The steals take it away. Tone down the steals. See? You look, listen. Hey, the fun of dribbling. We already can You see? The steals steals taking away the fun of the dribbling. That's what the fuck they want. All they want to do is dribble the whole fucking clock out. 2K, leave this shit the way it is. These dudes want to just dribble their life. I don't give a fuck who this man is. I don't give a fuck who he is. If, he, if all he want to do is dribble and not use his teammates and he, he can go kick rock. I don't give a fuck who he is. And this goes for anybody. If all you want to do is dribble, 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 and your man sitting in the corner, you kiss my ass too. But let's keep going. Can't dribble, okay? I'm not a dribble guy, guys. I'm a, I'm a one, two, three, four, five, you know? But he's saying, you know, it's taking the fun of dribbling. You telling me Hall of Fame unpluckable getting the ball taken like this? Let's be a hundred. And you know IRL Curry or Kyrie not getting the ball stolen this many times like. Now you ready? Hear me out. Isn't it funny? They mentioned Kyrie and Curry. And they mentioned Kawhi. I spent 48 hours. Y'all already know my setup. I stream here. I grind here. And I do my homework over here. Y'all already know the screens I have. Y'all already know my setup. I watched 48 hours. Listen to me. 48 hours. 48. 48. 48 hours of Kyrie Irving highlights of Kyrie Irving highlights 48 some of the battles of Kawhi Leonard and Kyrie Irving 
are epic. Kyrie getting stopped. Kyrie wasn't always able to get past Kawhi Leonard. What do you? Kawhi Leonard is killing, killing him. They killing him. Steph Curry. Steph Curry, bro. Steph Curry doesn't drop people off the way Kyrie would. But you ready? Watch how. Go, go, Google it. Go see how many times Kyrie Irving got shut down. I guarantee you, you're gonna find more videos when Kyrie Irving got locked down than when Kyrie Irving was was dribbling on dudes. And you ready? Kyrie Irving is an ISO player. Kyrie Irving is an ISO player. But it, it, isn't it funny that they want you to make the exception for these ISO players? No. Guess, guess what the next excuse is going to be? Oh, but if that's all he could do is dribble, he should be able to dribble. So if a man makes a lockdown and all he could do is lock down, he should be able to lock down, right? You see, the logic is not going to work over here. Over here on this page, you keep all that bullshit to the south. All that shit is whack. But let's keep on going. I, 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 I want you to watch some of these plays that this man was complaining about. Why? Because 2K22 spoiled niggas. Let's keep going. This from Kawhi. This is a fact. But um, It's not a fact. It's not a fact. It's absolutely not a fact. Because, ready? Kyrie Irving wouldn't dribble around four people expect not to get stripped. He wouldn't do it. I've seen all the highlights, and Kyrie's one-on-one. -on -one, and the minute he gets into traffic, he's either drop-stepping, passing the ball out. Kyrie Irving ain't, ain't, ain't dribbling up against two different dudes. He's not doing it. So let's stop the sh That's the cap. That's what I'm saying. We got to hold niggas accountable in this community that we all be following and listening to. But let's keep on going. A lot of people, man, they're so traumatized from skilled players that, I don't know. So Traumatized from skilled play. So you think dribbling the clock out takes skill, Swante? Come on, man. We got we to grow up, man. We got to grow Let's up. Let's look and see his claims. There is another dribble god, Hezzy. I think this is Hezzy. He got this uh, corny let's ass. Look. Uh, let's look. Let's look. Let's pay attention. So let, let's see. Now, these, look, you can tell by the guys they're playing, they look compish. You you run into some niggas with these like little brackets and stuff, they, they might be a little compy. Okay? So look, you can already tell by how he's moving, he's compy. A lot of y'all don't face comp. Okay? That steal right there, that's a bump steal. So thank you. Thank you. That is a bump I don't statement. know why this one's in the clip. Let, let, let's see. Let's see the other claims, man. Okay. Now. Wow. Wow. Oh. Damn. I see. Let's see the other claims. What are you damning? Man. Okay. Wow. Wow. Time out. You ready? Why is he? Wow. Wow. Why? You ready? Hold on. We're gonna do this together. We're gonna close this. We're gonna go right here. We're gonna go. We're gonna do this together. Pay attention. Pay attention, y'all. We all could read. We're gonna read this together, okay? We're gonna read this together. Vice grip increases a player's ability to secure the ball against steal attempts um, um, uh, against steal attempts after obtaining possession from a rebound, a catch, or a loose ball. Now, hold on, hold on, wait a minute. Let's, let's stay. We're gonna stay. Hold on, we're gonna stay right here. Hold on. See, I already seen that. We, we all read that right, 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 right here up top. We read it, right? Okay, now hold on. Hold on. Let's, because sometimes people have a hard time, you know, reading things. So let, let's, 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 let's go like this. We're going to go. Oh, no, 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 I'm bugging. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, ready? Listen, listen. We we all could read. We all read here. We all could read. Reduces the chances of getting stripped by the defender. Listen, key word, key. When performing dribble moves, the defender, 
defenders have a tougher time poking the ball free with their steal attempts. Okay. Let's close this. We're going to go back to this video. Now, we're going to go right here. See? And this is what yeah. I mean by let, let, let's see, let's holding see the folks accountable. Clients, man. Okay. Look. Wow. Why is he saying wow? Do you know what that right there is considered? That's considered vice grip. They inbounded the ball to you. You caught the ball. Maybe he doesn't have vice grip on. Did you ever consider that, Swante? Maybe he don't have vice grip. Did you ever consider that? Guess what? Because he, he wasn't dribbling the ball. He didn't activate unpluckable. That was vice grip. I'm just saying, we we got to hold everybody accountable. That is vice grip. He he wasn't dribbling the ball. He got the ball. He held it. And the guy came and stripped it. If that man has glove on Hall of Fame and you don't got vice grip, yeah, that's a steal. See what I'm saying? All these, all these other, all these dribble heads, all they want is an advantage in the game. They don't want the game to be real. They want what they doing to be, to be, to be, to be. OP for them because they get their viewership. That's bullshit. But let's keep going. Wow. Damn. I better not hear. I don't, I don't care. I know it's 90% of y'all that are in favor of these steals. <laughs> I just proved to you guys. See, he's like, wow. I just proved to you guys that that was a steal. Because if he don't have, we don't know what this dribbling guy has. Swante, do you know if he has vice grip on Hall of Fame? Do you know if he even has it on bronze? See what I'm saying? So we can't talk. We can't talk yet. But let's keep going. I know it. I know it. I know it. I'm going against the whole grain. But I don't care. Dude, if you genuinely think... I'm going to get into all the patch stuff too. But I, I wanted to talk about this real quick. If you genuinely think this is not insane, you're crazy. I better not hear. You crazy, Swante. He's just leaving the ball in front of him. I better not hear it, bro. Come on. Look. Hall of Fame unpluckable. Come on. Again, Swante, that has nothing. This play. Oh, I'm in your way. Hold on. This way. This way. We're going to watch it again. My fault, y'all. I didn't even realize that. He's just right leaving here. the ball in front of him. I better not hear it, bro. Right here. Come on. Hall of Fame unpluckable. Come on, bro. Bro. I'm going to say it again. That is not unpluckable. That is vice grip. He got the ball on the inbound. He doesn't have vice grip. Whose business is that? Whose fault is that? He don't have no badges. Whose fault is that, Swante? You see what I'm saying? And I'm going to have to hold you accountable. Because you're sitting here like, come on. That is not unpluckable. He's not dribbling the ball. He's not dribbling the ball. But let's keep going. Come on, bro. Nah, bro. That's, you this wrong. Is, this is crazy. You wrong. Okay? This is crazy. Nah, you crazy, Swante. Please let me know down below if you think this is Let's crazy Let's keep looking. This is crazy. Uh, can we all agree this is crazy? No. No one's going to agree to that. That was a strip. And a good strip. Let's see. Now look. <laughs> God damn. So hold on. So hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So hold on. So we're gonna complain about this, y'all. Look, 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 look. Bang! He just dribbled the ball back into the defender. That, that is. Oh my god! God damn! Swante, man, hold on. That isn't. That isn't. Once again, we don't know where his badges are on. That was, that was a, hold Damn, on, that's a basketball yo, steal, hold up. Yo, how many steals this thing? Damn. Hold on. Bang. God. I see, I see NBA players make steals like that. What are you complaining about? Swante, man, yo, Swante, you tripping, bro. I'm sorry, those on this video right here, you off the chain. You wildin'. Damn, yo, wildin'. yo, yo, how many steals this thing get? Hold yo, he, he's, yo, he's, he's great on defense. everyone. What the Bang! 
That's a legit. Come on, y'all. Come on. Now you ready? So what, Swante, are you going to say that he's running Hall of Fame Unpluckable 2? You don't know what the other man is running. But all you know is that Afro Dribbler told you, or whoever told you, they running Hall of Fame. But so you know that all these niggas is running Hall of Fame Unpluckable? Come on, man. Come on with the bullshit, man. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yo. Now look. Oh, we got a fun commercial. Of course we would. Grammarly adds confidence. Of course confidence, we would. So you don't undermine your message. Yeah, no, I don't do retakes. And offers rewrite. Yo, yo, this nigga get like eight steals this game. Hold on. <laughs> this guy's a great defender. Yo. Look. Yo. Hold on. Look. I need y'all to see this. So this isn't Whoa. great defense? <laughs> That's great. Look, right here. Look, 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 look. Yeah. That is great defense. Bro, this defender got him locked. You ready? You ready? How do you know he has, how do you know he has clamp, clamp killer, whatever on Hall of Fame? Because wait until I show you guys the next video. I want you guys to understand. Swante. Yo, yo, this nigga get like eight steals this game. Keep in mind, these are like compish people. Like it doesn't matter. Y'all played these people. Y'all like this. Everyone on this court, like the the person listening right now, they would probably beat y'all like twenty out of twenty times. Once again, that's the issue here, Swante. You're trying to favor the comp scene versus the game. If somebody's a lockdown and they don't have them badges, by all means, it's fair play. Fair play. I ain't coming at Swante. I always told y'all guys, I like Swante. Swante does good content. But you know what? This video right here, Swante, you tripping. I'm sorry. You, you, you straight, straight tripping. Now, we're going to go to the next video. Jersey made. Shout out to Jersey May. You know what I'm saying? A uh, fair use. Um, I want you to listen to the intelligence. Listen to the intelligence of this man. We're gonna get into this. I'm just gonna let the man talk. I don't even have anything. I don't have anything to say after. I'm gonna let him talk. Let's go. Jersey man, take it away. Range moves and there are long range moves. This is, is a major factor in knowing which animation you need to use to get past the defender as each crossover attacks different angles on the defender. Just like fighting games, using a short range attack in a long range situation and vice versa will get you the results you don't want. But let's first talk about what makes an animation long range or short range. Long range moves are moves that take longer to complete. Long range animations, even though the basketball may change hands, doesn't mean the animation is over. As you see right here, these are the windows that animations have and the windows will determine which crossover falls in the short or long range category. So the long range animations are the front crossover, in and out, hesitation, and the forward spin dribble. You'll want to use these moves when there is a significant gap between yourself and the defender. Using these moves in the tight spaces will result in a bump. Right? He makes sense so far, right? To get a crossover to work, we'll first want to get the defender leaning or moving laterally. As he's moving to position himself, flick the right stick towards your opposite hand. The front crossover is a great move for maintaining your momentum and making the distance to the basket much shorter because all the front crossover moves, regardless of the signature animation, ends with the dribbler attacking in a straight line. And the fastest way to get to any place is in a straight line. Jersey. I wanted to do this on live. You earned it. Today you earned that subscriber. Let's all give him a round of applause, please. Very well explained. I truly appreciate that video. Now, here we go. We're gonna go to the homie All City Live. Big shout out to the homie. Um, this is my other, my new channel right here. I, I haven't subscribed to my other channel. Uh, gonna subscribe right here. Right? Um. Fuck. 
fair use. I'm going to let the homie talk. I want you to listen to another person speaking about the, the dribbling and the steals. I want you to understand what logical thinking looks like, sounds like. Let's go. All City, take it away. So what are we doing wrong on NBA 2K23? The Nothing. 2K community is in an uproar about steals. If you're watching this video right now, please sound off in the comments section. Do you think steals should be nerfed? I have two players. One of them is a point guard. The other one is a lockdown. And when I run with my point guard, it sure is difficult to play against those lockdowns. Mm -hmm. But I got to tell you, I am not out there getting the ball ripped. And considering the idea that I'm not your ideal point guard, point guard is just not my role. Why? is it that i'm not getting stripped out there time out hear me out right why is it that i'm not getting stripped out there neither why when i'm with my kd build which you guys should go look at that build that build is crazy when i'm with my damian lillard build i'm not getting stripped i'm crossing over see but i like what he said I ain't your typical point guard. That's because most guys want to make these players with these high dribbling. And then when they can't do that, they panic. And they start crying, oh my God, 2K, 2K, please, please let us be demigods again. I can't be a demon. I can't be a demon. Why would y'all want to be a demon anyway? That shit is weird to me. I y'all do need jesus man anyway i'm gonna let him keep talking when i'm playing with my point guards i don't get ripped i'm not sure what's happening all city if you it's all city if you watch this i don't understand what's happening all city i'm with you here i don't understand it i don't get it i could be wrong but let's keep going Let's take some things into consideration. Playmakers and primary ball handlers don't have nearly as many badges at their disposal. Time out. This is true. I've made different point guard builds, and they some like you have to be like the little tiniest player in the world, these little ass arms to raise. It's so hard to get so many badges. Trust me. And like you're gonna have to compensate in so many different ways. But I will say this. Most people wouldn't understand this because you even have young kids. I ran with a few of these young kids, and all they want to do is dribble, 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 dribble. You ready? I am considered a Chris Paul. I am a Rajon Rondo, I'm a Steve Nash, I'm a Magic Johnson, I am, I am what you call a true point guard. My job is to make sure I distribute the ball efficiently, not just pass the ball like I'm like chicken out ahead. No, to get everybody involved, and I score whenever I need to score if I see I have an advantage. But let's 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 keep going as they used to. In NBA 2K22, primary ball handlers had damn near the world in their hands. Yep. But NBA 2K23 is thankfully a very different game than right. NBA 2K22. So what can we do different? If you guys have ideas, let me know in the comment section. I want to share some of my thoughts and what you guys can maybe do differently out there. And one of those things is just not... You, you, we forgetting something, y'all. Stamina is your most valuable commodity on NBA 2K23. And running a Against those lockdown bills out there, your stamina is draining very quickly. When your stamina drains, that makes it that much easier for those lockdowns to pick the ball. I've been watching. This is correct. You see, what people don't understand is this. When you raise up and you max out, when you max out your, your, your physicals and you max out your threes, and then you try to go max out your ball handling. I'm going to show you guys some gameplay. I've, I've been in the program already. I've been in the against some squads. I keep telling you, I already, showed, I already showed you guys the trick. 
When you see that little man run to the corner, pass the ball to the corner, and let that man play defense. We're not going to get into that right now. But this is the issue. Y'all want to dribble the whole stamina bar out. You guys use all your, your adrenaline running back and forth, and then you guys get mad because you can't do anything. And then when you go cold, you're getting robbed. You got to learn how to play the game within the, within the parameters. But, hey. Seeing a lot of gameplay from point guards and watching how they execute the offense against like elite type of defense. And I noticed that a lot of primary ball handlers are using like size up escapes to help create space and get a good opening for a shot or a drive. We gotta monitor how we use our turbo. We're not yep. gonna just blow by defenders in NBA 2K23. The primary goal is to just kind of take it easy right. at the point guard position. It's a much slower paced game. It's right. a high IQ game. This is why a lot of you hummus bummuses out there are complaining about steals getting nerfed. You goofies want to dribble in front of a lockdown knowing that your bar is depleting, your stamina bar is damn near blinking, and you're still out there trying to dribble knowing that your animations are going to be much slower than they were when you made it past that. And this is where we're going to stop. This is the problem. You have dudes who just want to dribble the whole life away, get ankle breakers, crossovers and that, just for their own personal gain, for their viewership, for the people who want to watch them. But it's an overall game. And if you can't control your stamina, if you don't know how to control your player and play better within the, within the limits of the game, then don't play 2K. Boycott this shit. Fuck it. Get off 2K. We don't want you here anyway. Because cause ready, hear me out. So then, if you're going to fight for the dribblers, then we got to fight for the bigs. And then if we can fight for the bigs, then we have to get, let, let the slashes be OP again. Because I be blocking the hell out of these slashes. Let the slashes be OP. Like, the whole, yeah, I'm tired of y'all little goo, like he said, y'all goofy, foofy niggas just crying and complaining. Stop the bullshit. But y'all know what time it is, man. Michael May, man. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, share the video, turn on notifications, because y'all already know I'm dropping bangers for y'all, man. Till next time, we are out.